Mark Hurst, Bit Literacy, Productivity in the Age of Information and Email Overload. In an era of information overload, it is crucial to master the art of handling digital data efficiently. Bit Literacy, Productivity in the Age of Information and Email Overload by Mark Hurst offers valuable insights for coping with this new reality. The book confronts the challenges of handling bits, the smallest units of digital information, and provides strategies to navigate the influx of emails, social media updates, and other digital distractions. In this summary, you'll discover the key techniques for managing your inbox, maintaining a clear to-do list, streamlining your media consumption, and organizing your files efficiently in the age of bits. Embracing the Digital Revolution For years, people relied on paper as a means of preserving and disseminating information. While it had its advantages in terms of durability and accessibility, paper also came with significant downsides like the need for physical space and slower transmission of information. Today, our world is driven by bits, tiny electrical impulses that occupy almost no physical space and can be transmitted incredibly fast. With the internet and various electronic devices such as laptops, smartphones, and cameras, the creation, storage, and transfer of bits have become far easier and more efficient. These versatile digital entities have transformed nearly every industry, freeing information from physical limitations and allowing instant global access. As a result, the world is witnessing an exponential growth in the number of bits utilized daily, signaling a new era of digital transformation. Overcoming Bit Overload In the digital age, we are constantly bombarded with information in the form of bits, leading to emotional and mental stress. This overload can result in two common responses, passivity and avoidance, or the always-on lifestyle. Both of these reactions contribute to stress and decreased quality of life. By adopting a bit literacy mindset, we can use our available resources and tools to efficiently manage the influx of information to regain control and actively choose what to focus on. While bits are simply electrical impulses with no weight, they seemingly have the power to weigh us down emotionally and mentally. With the increase of communication channels, such as text messages, social media platforms, and multiple email accounts, we're now more connected than ever, which can quickly become overwhelming. Many people have learned the basics of computer use, but few know how to cope with the growing influx of information. This leads to two reactions, passivity and avoidance or the always-on lifestyle. The former is demonstrated by cluttered inboxes and desktops, while the latter is marked by the urgent need to respond to every notification. Both approaches result in a loss of control, accumulating stress, and decreased productivity. It impacts our relationships, too, as we often prioritize fiddling with our devices over valuable face-to-face -face interactions. To regain control, we must aim to reduce the information load to zero, making room for active decision-making. Bit literacy can help us achieve this goal. By efficiently managing incoming information and developing strategies to delete, filter, and let go of unnecessary bits, we can work towards a state of emptiness. In the upcoming sections, we will explore tools and techniques to engage with bits on our terms, allowing us to maintain a healthier relationship with the digital world. Unclutter your email inbox. The widespread misuse of email inboxes contributes to clutter, disorganization, and a lack of productivity. To optimize workflow, users should adapt their email management by separating content from notifications and maintaining an empty inbox through daily routines. Prioritize tasks by transferring them to the appropriate platforms such as to-do lists or calendars, and avoid using email inboxes for storage, reminders, or as alternatives to other organization tools. Imagine yourself diving into an ocean of unread emails, it's overwhelming, isn't it? But it doesn't have to be this way. Email inboxes are often mismanaged and overburdened because people use them for purposes they were never intended for hindering effective workflows and causing unnecessary stress. One common mistake is treating the inbox as a to-do list, relying on reminders sent via email. 
This creates distractions and makes it difficult to prioritize tasks among all other messages. Likewise, storing passwords, contacts, lists, and bookmarks in your inbox only adds to the chaos and confusion. To declutter and regain control, start by matching the content of emails with the right tools. When an email requires action, such as writing a report, move the task to a to-do list, where it can be prioritized alongside other responsibilities. Similarly, save dates to calendars, store addresses in your address book, and keep links in a bookmark folder. Establishing a daily routine of emptying your inbox streamlines your workflow and frees up time for essential tasks. Start by enjoying personal emails from friends and family, saving meaningful ones in a designated folder and discarding the rest. Next, sort through newsletters and informational messages, either reading them if time permits or deleting them altogether. Lastly, handle any remaining to-dos, those that take less than two minutes should be completed immediately, while others can be moved to your to-do list. By adopting these habits, you'll transform your overwhelming inbox into an efficient gateway for your daily tasks, thereby improving your time management skills and enhancing overall productivity. Mastering Bit Literate To-Do Lists Experience the satisfaction of an empty inbox by transitioning to a more efficient digital to-do system, Good To Do. This versatile tool enables prioritization of tasks in a daily calendar view, smart scheduling, and effortless creation of reminders. Good To Do simplicity makes it perfect for managing your schedule, following up on tasks, and ensuring nothing slips through the cracks. Replace your notepads and post-its with a user-friendly digital to-do tool, Good To Do, designed to keep up with the pace of our modern world. This indispensable resource offers a prioritizable daily to-do list and accompanying calendar, allowing you to concentrate on the tasks at hand without fretting over future obligations. Only see the tasks assigned for a specific day, eliminating distractions posed by other pending tasks. Save time and prevent demoralization caused by constant exposure to unactionable future tasks. Turn the simplicity of good to-do to your advantage by effortlessly creating to-dos through forwarding or CCing an email. The subject line automatically becomes the to-do summary, and the message body is stored as additional details. Maximize the benefits of good to-do by incorporating it into your everyday workflow, such as setting reminders for follow-ups. Experience the advantages of a well-structured, bit-literate to-do system that keeps you in control and more organized than ever before. Curate your media diet. Don't let the immense amount of information available today overwhelm you. Instead, cultivate a focused media diet from sources that consistently offer valuable content. Keep in mind the purpose behind consuming each piece of media and ask yourself if it's worth your time. Stay clear of the race to be an expert on everything it's neither reasonable nor healthy. In today's age of vast information access, you might feel the pressure to keep up with every topic and be a part of every conversation. But trying to read every available source is not only impossible, it's also a mentally unhealthy pursuit. Once upon a time, people had limited media options, but with the internet revolution, we're now bombarded with countless options. It's not practical to engage with all of them. Instead, take control by tailoring your own media diet from a select few sources that provide precisely the information you need. Pay attention to the sources that consistently impart valuable information and are worth reading thoroughly, while identifying other sources suitable for skimming. Each time you consume media, consider why you chose that particular content. Was it informative or amusing to you before? Did it provide crucial information? Reflection on these aspects will help refine your media diet further. Keep it light and always ask yourself if a piece of content truly deserves your attention. Streamline your digital world. A cluttered desktop filled with files and folders is a familiar sight for many people. To combat this, adopt a minimalistic, two-level storing system with effective naming conventions. Whether it's documents or photos, focus on quality over quantity, keeping only the most valuable content. Doing so will not only simplify and streamline your digital world but also make it easier to access and manage your important files. 
It's no secret that most of us have desktops that are a jumbled mess, characterized by haphazard organization. To restore order, consider adopting a minimalist two-level storing system. Start by creating individual, top-level, folders for each project or undertaking. Your folders can range from academic pursuits, like your master's thesis, to personal projects, like cooking or novel writing. The beauty of this structure lies in its simplicity. For each top-level folder, you're only allowed one sub-level of folders. For instance, if you have a work folder, you could create subfolders for email threads, deliverables, memos, and team contact information, but that's it, no deeper nesting. With only two layers of folders, you can avoid drowning in a sea of digital clutter. Another essential element in this organization technique is devising a consistent and informative naming system for your files. Each part of the file name should convey crucial information. For instance, label documents with the author's initials, the date, and the subject, example, JS0122 book draft. When you save files this way, your computer will automatically sort them. For many of us, photos constitute a large proportion of our digital files. While snapping photos has become effortless and cost-free, it's crucial to focus on quality, not quantity. Sift through your vast collection of images, keeping only the truly exceptional shots and discarding duplicates and lackluster pictures. By adopting these straightforward strategies, you can eliminate chaos and confusion from your digital world, making the process of organizing, finding, and managing files a breeze. Mastering BitLiterate Communication When sharing information online, it's crucial to be mindful of how it's presented. Effective BitLiterate communication utilizes front-loading, providing the most important information first in a succinct manner. This technique applies to subject lines and main content in emails, PowerPoints, documents, and memos. Including relevant context is essential for conveying the right message. When sending links, provide sufficient details to avoid burdening the recipient with extra work. Sharing valuable digital information with others is natural, but the way it's shared is equally important. Embrace the bit-literate message structure, which prioritizes efficiency and clarity by quickly providing the essential points and supporting them with relevant information, known as front-loading. For instance, instead of a vague subject line like everything you need to know about the upcoming conference in Chicago, opt for a concise version such as Chicago Conference, Schedule, Agenda, Directions. This front-loading approach ensures better comprehension, delivers information promptly, and applies to emails, PowerPoint presentations, documents, and memos. Be mindful of the context when conveying information. Emails, by default, offer details like date, sender, and subject line. In contrast, PowerPoints, documents, and memos necessitate the inclusion of contextual elements, such as who, when, for whom, and why. Consider the recipient's time constraints, as everyone faces information overload. For example, when sharing a link, don't assume your friend knows its purpose. Help them understand its significance by providing a concise description, including the URL, source, date, author, and a brief explanation of its importance. Attach the article's full text for convenience, so the recipient doesn't have any extra legwork. By adopting bit-literate communication methods and front-loading, you can present information effectively, save time, and enhance mutual understanding. Mastering Keyboard Shortcuts The mastery of keyboard shortcuts is a game-changer, allowing for quick and efficient computer usage. By minimizing mouse usage and automating repetitive tasks with dedicated programs, you can save valuable time and optimize your workflow. Keyboard shortcuts and one-touch access enable a seamless connection between thought and action, while customization of these shortcuts reinforces productivity. Imagine watching someone start their car by opening the hood, tinkering with wires, and then finally getting back in the driver's seat. You'd probably wonder why they didn't simply use the ignition. This scene is analogous to how computer-savvy individuals view others using a mouse to perform tasks that could easily be done with keyboard shortcuts. Using keyboard shortcuts instead of the mouse saves time and effort, as typing can be much faster and more intuitive. 
By learning these shortcuts, you'll be able to navigate and control your digital environment effortlessly and efficiently. Several programs exist to further harness the power of the keyboard. For example, Quick Keys allows users to assign specific keys to various applications. This means that with a single press, you can instantly open your email client, text editor, or browser. In addition to these one-touch shortcuts, most programs have built-in hotkeys for essential operations. Suppose you want to save an article's text, press Ctrl-A to select it, Ctrl-C to copy, and then use your custom hotkey, example F6, to open your text editor. Create a new file with Ctrl-N, paste the content with Ctrl-V, and save it using Ctrl-S, all in under 5 seconds. Another productivity enhancer is using software like Tipinator to automate repetitive tasks. This tool allows users to create custom abbreviations for frequently typed phrases and correct spelling errors on the go. By recognizing the phrases you frequently use, you can develop shortcuts to save time and effort. Embrace the world of keyboard shortcuts and revolutionize your computer experience while maximizing productivity. Mark Hurst's Bit Literacy is an essential guide to thriving in the age of information overload. The book emphasizes the importance of establishing healthy habits to manage emails, keep a well-organized to-do list, maintain a balanced media diet, and manage your files effectively. By implementing these strategies, you will regain control of your daily life, increase productivity, and improve your overall well-being. In Mastering Bit Literacy, you will be better equipped to navigate the complexities of the digital age and make informed decisions, among the myriad of available choices.